Yeah, we may get off light today because everybody's off. Maybe. Yeah, we're gonna get off light today because everybody's off. Maybe. Okay, so. The one thing that sucks is we don't have a bathroom, so I really have to pee, and um, I'm going to go right over there to the service center, let me just show you. Um, this is where we're, we're in the parking lot of a physical therapy place, and luckily we have a drive around this way, they can circle around the building. Um, they're not open today, so I'll just go over to the oil change place right there, and go pee, but like my husband just went to get breakfast, so I was just like, ah! I'll show you our signage. So I take the cooler out, take the trash out. I gotta open the cooler and drain it. I wish, one thing I wish we had is a counter, um, if we had installed a counter ice holder, um, which we still could install right here, but we just really don't have the space. This is where our wands go, which my husband leaves this wand on for me because he knows I'm gonna drink a coffee. That's my reward for cleaning. So, some of you guys have seen other videos, but this is what it looks like when it's rolling. We've got the syrup strapped in, everything is hooked to the wall, the menu comes in. I'm going to open this window before I absolutely die. Whew. So, the menu's gotten some changes. I'll throw in a screenshot, hopefully, of the menu, but I kind of redid it. Prices are the same, though. So, here's where all our stuff goes when we're rolling. I take all this in and wash and sanitize it in the house because by the time he's done with a day, his gray tank is pretty much full. So you have your clear tank. What is that? Fresh tank. I don't know if I showed this previously, but my friend Nikki painted me us this painting and I absolutely love it. It's so 80s, so wonderful, and that's our last name. And then she also painted this one for me. And then we keep our occupational license and our tax stuff up there and like dates that I don't need to forget because we're doing a market. And yeah, so I'll show you real quick. We've been selling cinnamon rolls um, from a woman locally. They are awesome. She is awesome. And I mean, people are just wild about these cinnamon rolls. They sell out within like two hour time. And then we get awesome different varieties of fresh muffins. And so we just alternate the days that we have muffins or cinnamon rolls, and people love that. Also, we started saying, please drive through on our sign, because it's making it a lot more efficient um, and than people walking up. So um, I showed, I think we finally got our own sleeves. Yes, it's so great, so great. I reordered, and I didn't order the back, because it costs a little more to get the back printed. So, And then our register... Our eBay register is kind of losing its grip on life here, but it's fine. It still does the calculating, so that's great. So, refrigerator is strapped closed, and I always come in here and take everything out and clean up like that. But that's our little fridge, y'all. This is just a Walmart fridge. Nothing fancy or high-tech. And we also added another Breville Pro. So we had a different Breville, but the Pro is the way to go. Um, these are these are awesome. I think they pull great shots. They steam milk excellent. The only issue is you have to refill the water tanks manually. And you have a pretty small hopper for your espresso beans, but you just have to stay on top of it. And the lower grade model did not tell us when it was out of water, so um, these are super automated. Matter of fact, I'm going to pull me a shot. And it's going to tell me I need to fill the tank and I need to flush and descale. So I think I'm going to use our newer machine. It's also telling me to fill the tank. So you have to un unload the tanks when you drive because it'll all spill out everywhere. So let's pull a shot, make a little drink, and get to cleaning. All right, so another thing that is new is we added 24 ounce ice cups. 
so we had just 20 ounce cups and we had requests for bigger cups so went ahead and got the 24 ounce cups the lids fit the straws work everything's cool so people also want us to get 24 hot cups but you know summer's coming and hot drinks just take longer because you have to steam the milk and um, another thing we did with that was we bumped up the price of um, this is my coffee from earlier so I gotta rinse it out don't judge me I'm trying to save the world my guilt about plastic is overwhelming but I like my cup so anyways um, we bumped up the price of oat milk and almond milk for the 24 ounce just because um, I'll show you the oat milk. Let me show you. Oh, I'm using this one. Did I fill up this one? I guess I'm using this one. So, oat milk is like $3 and something for this, right? If you get a 20, a 20 ounce hot drink, it's going to use half of that. So we only charge 85 cents for oat milk. Um, but with the 24 ounce, we charge a dollar, which is only a little bit more, but it's going to help cover that cost. We also ditched the glass cups and started using these. Um, we've also gotten a new coffee roaster. This is almost empty now. Um, but yeah, we switched roasters, still local, still organic, um, and it's great. I love it. And whoo, this one, not only is it organic, but it is fair trade, and they just mail it to us. It's They're only an hour from here, but they just ship it out every Monday. Let me focus here. All right, so there it is, Louisiana Roasting Company. So that is awesome. And here is this beautiful espresso. So we, were, we kept like chipping our glass um, catchers, whatever you call those glass shot glasses. So we switched to this, um, this little tin one and it works great. So let me go ahead and get some ice and I'll make my drink. I really only drink ice anymore. Um, so here it is. Ow! It's a nice double shot. It's hot. Um, I think I'm going to put a little caramel in mine today. But I, we don't do cold brew. I don't like it. I haven't been able to master it. And I prefer the fresh espresso taste. Americano. So with the 24, you can still have your big drink. It lasts just a little bit longer so we also do not put a double I mean an extra shot in this um, if people want to they can just put an extra shot in it so yeah and I hate this oat milk I don't know if I just need to get a new oat milk people don't mind it I hate it I absolutely hate it and but I love almond milk so usually we just get the original but they had only vanilla unsweetened though so yeah let's drink this and clean So I really like to taste my coffee, and that is just perfect. I do not know how people drink a drink with like 10 pumps of flavor, I just like a couple most of the time. So coffee grinds are going to go on the blackberries today, and I actually have a whole bag of it in my trunk as well. I usually keep a bucket in the truck so that my husband can not throw it in the trash because that breaks my heart. So, yeah, so that's good. So I reuse my cup and my lid and my straw like 10 times until it, something just happens to it because, like I said, I love having a plastic cup. It adds to the effect of my drink, but I have extreme plastic guilt already. All right, you guys are up on my little cup lid holder, so hopefully you don't break it. Um, but I gotta get something done. 
We have a softball game for my daughter this afternoon, so got to get this done, get dinner started. Um, so, so thankful that my husband put a little air conditioner in this thing. He just made a hole in the side of it, and we got an air conditioner. But you don't want to be in a black box in Louisiana in the summer, even with an air conditioner. We're probably going to be hurting. We might back our hours up to noon. We're closing at 1 right now, 7 to 1. Um, well, we might back those hours up, but it has gotten busier. So I'm really glad that we didn't stress out those first three months when, you know, we would have days where we were just sitting there, you know. Come here, puppy. My husband and I were just sitting there going, oh my gosh, you know, and we were a little bit nervous. But that's why we started out like super basic. Like we didn't make custom sleeves we didn't do t-shirts right away we didn't do all that extra stuff because we just didn't know if it would work um but i actually think that i can say that i think it's gonna work um and it, but it's just us so we just do monday through friday um because we're old um so yeah, it's just us. We do have an event next Saturday in um, one of the big cities near here. Um, the city we're in is about 12,000 and we're going to a city with probably 100,000 or more. Um, so that'll be fun. It's a little downtown market, mercantile market thing. Um, so that'll be our first event in that city and that's where our coffee comes from. So that'll be cool. Hopefully that'll get us even more on the map. And then, if you saw the other video, we were um, involved in an HGTV um, hometown kickstart reveal. We weren't really involved. Alrighty. So I don't even know how much of what I just recorded recorded because I ran out of card space. So, there's still coffee in there. Hot in here too. Yeah, I'm not gonna waste. There's beans in there. I'm not wasting those beans. Maybe I am. All right. So, a couple more things I wanted to show. Coffee truck friends. Um, I've got all of our supplies in this bin right here, and I do need to check that and make sure I'm fully stocked. But I think it's good. I gotta double check. I've been doing a lot better at staying staying on the ordering because ordering is something you gotta stay on top of. Okay, can you see me now? So I got a sweep. Say hi. Hi, my name's Charlie. I look like coffee. You look like a latte. You look like a latte with cream. What I'm doing now is filling up the water tank, fresh water tank. Um, and something that we learned is that, we should have known, but you should have, your gray water tank should be bigger than your fresh water tank because think about you're having um, extra coffee and like leftover coffee and stuff go down your drain so your, your tank is going to fill up and that's something that we've run into where when we do events we can only run for about four hours at full capacity and then it's full and we either have to like pull away somewhere and go find somewhere to drain our water or just call it quits but honestly we did some events and uh we were running just full speed for five hours and by then between the two of us and my husband's a smoker like he's so grumpy and we're just tired so I just tell people when we do events like we can only do like about four hours depending on how busy it is so um, that's really cool.
so that's that's where we're at so sometimes it's nice to be older and less ambitious and less out to impress people because we just we just want to make money and enjoy our life so thank you for coming to Cafe Desatel aka Cloud9 Coffee and I hope if you're watching that you learned something or got inspired or you know anything um, maybe you are now wishing you could have a cup of coffee I'll throw in some clips of my favorite drink. My favorite drink right now is the French Haze. Oh, so good. And people love it. I'm like, I made this and you love it. So that is like one of the best feelings, especially I just love coffee. So I will uh, catch you guys next time. Cheers.